Hey folks, Pastor Jay here, Trinity Lutheran Church, our weekly video announcements. Nice to see you. Uh, we had a fantastic Sunday at our uh, on July 4th, so thank you to everyone who participated in that. Uh, it was just a, what a great uh, day to celebrate um, our faith in the midst of our country. So we were excited about that, so thank you for being a part of that. Check it out. Um, everything's back online, so if you wanted to see how we did, uh, it was just really an, an amazing day. So thank you for that. Um, but most of all, starting this Sunday, we are going to begin a new series called Binging the Bible, or Binge Reading the Bible, I think is what it's called. Uh, we're going to talk about creation. We're actually going to walk through seven weeks of uh, different genres through there. So you'll hear about the Gospels, you hear about um, apocalyptic literature, we'll hear about wisdom literature, a lot of, you know, basically how the Bible is structured. Uh, so bring your Bibles with you on Sunday so we can jot some notes and, and, and write some stuff in the, in the uh, margins. Uh, we really want you to, to open up your Bibles so we can really get into to that and uh, just kind of lift up the Word of God this week. So that begins this week. It'll run for seven weeks. We're excited about it. Numerous voices you'll hear uh, that'll be proclaiming God's Word through that. So thanks for being a part of our worship community. Uh, we look forward to seeing you in person or online on Sunday. And God loves you and so do I. Hey everyone, just wanted to give you a quick reminder that we are back to our normal worship times this Sunday. July the 11th, 9 o'clock, and 11 a.m. We hope to see you either in person or online. Have a wonderful week, and God bless. Hi, I'm Mary Kay Coughlin. I'm Food Ministry Director here at Trinity Lutheran Church. And I'm Ben Lander, Outreach Director. And we have a lot of dates and times for you, just like we did last week. So if you missed it or you forgot to get out your pen last week, do it now, because <laughs> here they come. All right, so we're still getting ready for our free yard sale event on July 18th. And in order to do that, we still need to sort things. So tonight, from 6 to 7.30 p.m., in the egg room, the place where we used to sell the eggs, which is across in Fellowship Hall here at Trinity, uh, we are doing uh, our first sort of the items that people have already donated. We do need a couple of more volunteers, so if you're available tonight, Send us a, a text or an email, and or just show up. That's fine, too. <laughs> as long right. as it's at 6. <laughs> as long as it's at 6. Um, yeah, and then in addition to that, our second sort night is going to be next Thursday, the 15th, also at the same time, in the same place, uh, in the Egg Room in Fellowship Hall at 6 o'clock. And we need about four or five volunteers for that as well. Oh, don't forget, we have one in, the, have after one. in, in the afternoon from 1 to 2.30 p.m. Uh, that's also on July 15th, and we need about three or four more volunteers for that. And then on Saturday, July 17th, we actually have two different things going on at the same time. So they're both happening from 1 to 2.30 p.m. Those of you who would like to help with our final sort, the final sorting of all the things that have been donated to us, you're going to be with Ben mm -hmm. in the egg room in Fellowship Hall. If you would rather help me pack groceries for our grocery giveaway that we're doing at the same time as the yard sale, then you need to be in the food closet at 1 p.m. I need about six more volunteers. Ben, you don't have any help yet. So come out and help him. It's not fair for him to do it all by himself. <laughs> no, but we really could use a lot of help. So that's all on the 17th. So there's a lot of uh, sorting and getting things ready so that on the 18th now, <laughs> there's a lot of things uh, that we need just for setup and such. So the 18th is the day of the event. The actual event is going to be at 2 p.m., but we need help setting up before that at about 12.30. And so we're set taking all the things that we sorted out into the parking lot. We're setting up tables and things like that. So we'll need um, about a dozen volunteers or so uh, the day of to help us set up. And then also for the event, which is 2 to 4. Yeah, and for the event... Um, all the items are free, so there isn't any money collection. We're just a little concerned about things getting misplaced or moved off of the general area where they're supposed to be um, after we've sorted them or the wind blowing them away. Helping people, if they're looking for something specific, you can direct them to the right table. Uh, we also have some ministries that are going to be coming out and putting up uh, tables and, and letting people know what they do. Um, so they may need a little bit of support. Yeah, we could also use help just uh, with hospitality, greeting people, talking to them, saying, hey, welcome, and uh, praying with them. We'll have prayer tables up. Um, so The Stephen ministers will be, mm -hmm. um, will be here praying with our clients. Uh, and then cleanup. Uh, we have a, a plan for cleaning up really, really quickly from uh, 4 to 5 p.m. And uh, so we're looking for some volunteers for the day of. So if you can help us with that, please email either one of us. 
um, and let us know. Yeah. That's all that we have for now. Stay tuned for more. Um, and yeah. we'll see you all later. <laughs> have a Go. blessed week. Hey, it's Lori Hinman, your Life Teams Director at Trinity, and I have a couple announcements for you. Uh, some of it you probably already heard, but just a reminder, uh, three Bible studies still going on. Book of Philippians with Pastor Chuck and Pastor Jay. That's Thursday nights at 7. And the Book of uh, First and Second Kings, that's a men's study, Tuesday nights at 6.30. And then a women's study called It's Not Supposed to Be This Way. Uh, that is also Tuesday nights, but it's at 7. All three of those studies are either in person or on Zoom. You can contact me for any of um, that information. I can get you hooked up with the teacher. Um, my email is lhinman at trinityjapa.org. Uh, don't forget to sign up for our women's retreat. We're getting to the point where we'll need to drop some spaces if we um, don't feel like we're going to fill all of our hotel rooms. So again, if you're on the fence, let me know. Um, don't forget you can come just Saturday only. Um, and that is $70, and you get all your meals, um, we'll have a campfire at night, all your retreat materials. And um, so even if you don't want to come for the whole weekend, we'd love to see you for Saturday only. Um, and the thing, uh, two things I want to talk to you about. Um, one is, is really exciting. It's a new, um, our new travel group. It's called Trips Up. And they're having their first trip in October. And I wanted to actually read you some of the things that they're going to do because it is, if you can see this, it is a whole list of things that they're going to jam into four days. October 4th through 8th, they're doing a uh, steam train excursion. They are going to uh, Mystic Seaport. They are doing a tour of the city of Boston. They are doing a Boston Harbor cruise. Um, they are doing a main gauge uh, railroad trip and museum ride. Um, Old Port Portland for lunch. They're going to um, a lighthouse, lighthouse lovers cruise. They're going to the Shipyard, Shipyard Brewery in Portland. They're going to do a Maine lobster bake. Um, another railroad uh, ride on, on the last day, a Mount Washington cruise and lunch. Um, all that, and all that stuff and a little bit more that I didn't even have time to read, but all of that in four days, October 4th through 8th. It's going to be perfect fall uh, leaf weather. Um, it's going to be great up there. Your um, deposit is due very soon. They need to make sure they have enough people to go. So contact Barb Gorton. Her email is barbagorton, G-O-R-T-O-N, at hotmail.com. And she can get you connected. Their first information meeting will be August 1st, which is a Sunday. They're going to do a 4 o'clock dinner at Baldwin Seafood Restaurant on Route 40. And then just a reminder, I know Pastor Jay kind of talked about this a little bit, but our uh, churchwide study sermon series called Binge Reading the Bible is beginning this weekend. So um, look for that. They're going to start with the books called the Pentateuch, and uh, it's the first five books of the Bible. So listen for that. Small group material or study along material is available in the narthex at the table that has the sign resource center over the top of it. Um, I can also email that to you if you'd like. Uh, go ahead and email me and I'll email you back a PDF file of the material. And that's all I have. I'll talk to you guys soon. Hey guys, it's Dave Merritt, Youth and Family Ministries Director here at Trinity Lutheran with a couple announcements. First off, our Sunday School announcement. We are back this week, but just at the 11 a.m. service. This week's theme is Good News Shoes. Our July family event is Family Olympics. It will be on Sunday, July 25th from 3 to 5 p.m. on the Trinity Field and Pavilion. Please RSVP by using the QR code or email me, dmerit at trinityjapa.org. And last but certainly not least, our youth group announcement. Please either text or email me if you can serve at the Shelter Service Day on Thursday, July 15th, or the Free Yard Sale at Church on Sunday, July 18th. I'm Dave Merritt. Have a great week!